Hey everyone, I have returned. Now, has anyone seen the very first video of the day? If not, smash that bell, and of course, you will get a notification from YouTube. And don't worry, I'll discuss my social media accounts when this video is completely over. Thank you very much. Now, once again, I want you guys and gals to sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to drink. Or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and the subject. And, of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Once again, there will be an article. Story time. Now, be honest. Did you guys like the WCW invasion angle with the WF and, and ECW? I enjoyed it. It was something different at the time. Now, probably some of you did not care for it because they didn't have the major players from WCW. You know why? They're under contract from Time Warner. A lot of them just sit on their butts until their contract expired. Can you imagine if the major player from WCW was part of this angle? I guarantee that would be a 10 times better angle. That one and even the Survivor Series. Yeah, what if, right? What if? But it never happened, so we have these mid Carters duking out and some of these top stars from you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna do off you have these top stars but no top star from WCW in that angle in my opinion. Am I wrong? Am I right? It was very different but they could do way better if the top stars did not have had to sit home from time one or contract from AOL many years ago you know what if the top stars were there from you know invasion in july and then they ended it at the survivor series 2001 people will go to the show and even buy the pay-per-view from back in the day people did buy that pay-per-view and people did attended it but probably would be double the amount you know what i'm saying but what if and who will win the invasion angle who would what was the original plan, do you think? You know? That'd be nice. The original plan that WCW won it and get revenge or some of that, you know? I know they dominate the WF the ratings, but can you imagine if they actually beat them in a match on the Invasion and the SRR series? That'd be insane. But whatever. McMahon said, nope. It's WF for life. You know, until they change it back in the old tube. So, you agree with um, Bruce Richards or disagree? Let me know what you think. You know? So, um, the old one, 2001 era from the WF was gold. It really was. They had amazing stages. They put a lot of effort. Now, like in today's my era, they don't put no effort on these stages for these shows. I don't know why. Maybe because it's time consuming. And the pyro was amazing every time you tune into the 2001 era in the year. It was awesome. You get amazing video packages. They don't do that more, probably because they realize that too much time consuming. And then they used to have pyro all the time on Raw back in the day, every damn time. But now they don't do it more. Once in a blue moon. What's the point of having? Raw and SmackDown. If you don't have Pyro, come on, WWE, do better. You know, you guys could do it. And I guess they spend a lot of money on Pyro for WrestleMania. So maybe they, maybe that's why. I love Pyro, a lot of other stuff. So, what's your thoughts in this? Do you agree with Bruce Richards or disagree with Bruce Richards? Now, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. Now, if you want to be part of the Robert Show, that's fine. If not, that's okay. But if you change your mind, that's fine too. Um, everyone out there, enjoy the rest of your Sunday, and I'll be back tomorrow. Peace out and stay safe. Thanks for watching.